everybody and welcome back to my little channel. Today I'm filming a fashion video and I don't do that many fashion videos on my channel at all, mainly because I can't be bothered. I don't know why, I just, I'm not a fashion person every day of my life, if I can get away with it, if I'm at home, I just throw on leggings, a t-shirt or leggings and a jumper as demonstrated today because that's comfortable, that's what I like to wear, it's not because I think that's what looks good, that's genuinely because that's what I want to wear because it's comfortable. I do have a few pieces though here which I do wear when I go out, um, what I mean by going out is leaving the house and visiting friends or going out places with friends. I will put on an outfit that might be a little bit more better than the leggings and t-shirt that I would wear at home. But it is a very rare occasion that I actually wear something that I consider fashionable. So I've got a few pieces which are my favourite um, fashion purchases that I've ever made. And these aren't necessarily fashionable pieces. They're not necessarily pieces that I would say are, you know, trendy or particularly good. But there's something about the item of clothing that I think is worth the money or something that I just love to wear. So there's not that many, and I didn't want to pick too many for this video because I wanted to keep it quite short. I didn't want to start waffling on, you know, how it can be. So there is quite a few things that I haven't included in this video that I think I probably should, but I just didn't want to, you know, overload the video. I am going to do chatty videos like the one today where I sit down, talk through items, um, and not try them on. And then I'm going to do videos like lookbooks and try on videos where I actually show you the clothing on and be a little bit more adventurous and experimental. But today it's just going to be very casual, very chill. So get yourself a cup of tea, get sat down and get watching. Let's get into the video. I'm gonna start with t-shirts because that seems logical to me. And the first one is this like little kind of vest t-shirt thing here. I actually got this for Christmas. I asked for it from my mum because I just literally saw it on the Black Friday sales and thought, oh, you know, if you wanna get me something, get it now. Um, so it was five pounds. I believe it was probably half price from Misguided. Is it misguided? Yeah, misguided, just for reference. Um, and this is a size 10, just for reference. Um, but what I like about this is that it's black and it has the words London written on it. Obviously it's not how you spell London at all, but you know, do you know what I mean? It's just, uh, that's what it says on it. You can read yourself. Um, and this is a great item to put underneath, say a hoodie or a jumper or something like that, just in especially English weather conditions. Because yesterday I went to um, an ice cream place with my friend Steph and Ben and I wore a hoodie because it was kind of a little bit chilly when I left the house and it was also quite dull. But then whilst we were there, it got so warm. So I was wearing this underneath and it's not too thick so that you don't feel like really, really hot um, with a hoodie on as well. Um, so that actually I got so hot that I took my hoodie off, wrapped it around my waist and I had this on. So it's just that kind of perfect item for summer because it really does let you breathe. There is, you know, no sleeves or anything. So yeah, it is really good for the summer and I've been loving kind of wearing this under clothes so that if I do get warm, I can take my hoodie off, which is what I do do. I do do. Oh, it's what I do do. Anyway, um, so there's that as the first piece and yeah, it's a good one. Next up is one that I was debating whether to put in this because I have mentioned it in several videos before and I thought to myself, Georgie, what, were you doing? what are you doing? You wear this all the goddamn time. Put it in this video because it is the best, probably the best fashion purchase I've ever made. This was from H&M and this is a t-shirt dress. I wear this all the time, like all the time. This is what it looks like. Firstly, I love the colours pink, black and white. D doesn't this just like, that's like a purpley pink. Doesn't these color combin this colour combination just satisfy the screen that you are watching this video on? That just looks cool. I just love that. And that's what drew, you know, drew me initially to this t-shirt dress. This is what it looks like. When I tried this on in the changing rooms, I believe I bought this about a year ago, but when I tried this on in the changing rooms, you know, I was like, yeah, I'll give it a go. 
loved it as soon as i put it on it i feel like it suits me i get i got a lot of compliments on it at school when i first wore this and people always say that they really like it I personally love it for the design and the colours and I also love it for the fact that I can just throw it on with some tights, leave the house and you're good to go. You're just done. It's a simple, quick, easy outfit. H&M do some amazing t-shirt dresses. I think I have three or four t-shirt dresses from them, including this one. And my love for t-shirt dresses came from when I bought this. So those are the t-shirts. Now for some jumpers. I know we're in summer. I know we're in summer, but but Georgie loves jumpers, so do not judge. I am a jumper person through and through, as you can see. Do not take them from me. Do not tell me I've got too many. Do not tell me I wear too many, because I know I wear a lot, but I don't wear too many. There is never too many jumpers in a collection. Thank you, I'm glad we cleared that up. Seriously, if I did this video in winter, you would be at absolutely mind blown at the you know at the start of my previous channel I did a video on my jumper collection and I had about over 20 to 30 jumpers now if I did that video I think I would have people come around to my house and and tell me off for buying too many jumpers but I wear them all I wear them all okay the first one is a jumper dress so slightly different like with the t-shirt dresses, I like something that you can just throw on, full outfit, bing, bang, bong, done. So you don't have to think about it too much. This, move in a bit. This is obviously for winter. I'm not going to be wearing it in the summer, but I just, this is an all time favourite fashion purchase. purchase. Sorry. And I got this from Boohoo. I got it in a size 12 because I wanted it to be kind of a little bit oversized. It's a little bit high neck, which I quite like. So, you know, it's quite, I don't know. It just looks nice with your face. I'm not very technical, as you can tell. Um, but it's got this kind of writing on it. Now, don't ask me what it says because I don't know. New York something. I can't read it. If you can read it, then well done. You've got a medal. But it's got that kind of cool writing down the side. And I just like the vibes of this jumper. It just... It just looks quite cool. It looks like something that's very much my style. I'm not a girly girl. I'm more of a person that likes to wear things that are a little bit more, I don't know, I'm not manly. I don't know how to describe it, but just not feminine. I don't know, a different kind of feminine. I just like stuff that's a little bit more cooler like this. Not a floaty, frilly dress, but, a, but I like a black um, jumper that has cool writing written on it it is quite long it's perhaps a little bit too long um but it's fine it's fine just a tad too long but i still wear it and i still love it and it's still one of my favorite purchases that i made the next one is probably one of my favorite jumpers if not my favorite jumper i'm so glad i bought this this was also from h&m it's just a plain gray jumper but it's got quite a high neck here as you can see so it's a good kind of roll neck um, or high neck, sorry, not roll neck. And so there's hairs everywhere. I'm molting. Oh. So yeah, as you can see, I love grey. Got this jumper on as well. Um, but what I love about this is that you can roll the sleeves up. And I just like, you know, isn't that just a satisfying sleeve to you? I don't know why. I just like it when sleeves roll up so satisfyingly neat. And obviously you can actually roll the neckline down as well if you want to. I don't tend to, I tend to leave it like that. But it's actually um, shorter at the front than it is at the back, as you can see. It just looks quite flattering. I don't know why it just does. I really like that personal style where um, jumpers are a little bit shorter at the front than they are at the back. It just adds a little bit more dimension to it, adds a little bit more shape, something a little bit different. And personally, I'm here for it. I really like it. So this was definitely worth the money in terms of cost per wear. My mum got the same jumper. She was debating whether to take it back. But throughout winter, she was wearing it all the time. I was wearing it all the time. We was in danger of wearing it on the same day together at the same time. But I wouldn't care because I don't care about that. Me and my friend Steph have got the same clothes, literally. We have the same of a lot of things. I think we once had the same bag, but in a different colour. Um, we've got a same blue t-shirt. I don't know if she remembers that. The same um, bomber jacket. 
the same kind of ready jumper. We have quite a lot of stuff that's the same, so I don't care if someone wears the same stuff as me at all. So yeah, um, but to be honest with you, Steph bought most of that stuff first and then I bought it after. So. Then finally, we have a hoodie. Got to include a hoodie. Hoodies in general are just my life. They really are. So I wanted to include one, but really this is representing them all. I could sit here and go through every single one and tell you best purchase, best purchase, best purchase. But I'm just going to sit down and tell you one hoodie and that represents all the other hoodies. So this one was a pretty good one. This one's from Romwee and it's a nice colour, nice kind of khaki green colour. It's got the typical Romwee kind of alien sticker on it, which I quite like. It adds a little bit of something something to the outfit, to the hoodie um the color of it i quite like because i don't have anything this color in my wardrobe so it's always good to include different colors in your wardrobe just kind of mix it up a little bit and i think this is actually a really nice shade of green in my personal opinion and i think in romwee in this particular hoodie anyway there was only one size like who do they think we are but anyway one size and if i'm honest with you it is actually quite small like I am a size 10 for hoodies or I can even fit into you know eights and even sometimes sixes as well um, but I always go for a 10 because I like it to be a little bit baggy. This is a little bit small on me so you can kind of you know I would say this is an eight. That's what I would say this is and if that's supposed to fit everybody then you know what kind of planet are they on? So hopefully they've changed that since I did you know my Romwe haul which was over a year ago. But yeah, it is a good hoodie. It's nice and warm. I like to throw it over the top of dresses. Um, the dresses that I wear are quite tightly fitted. So they, it doesn't look weird if you throw a hoodie on top. It just looks like a hoodie with a skirt. So yeah, this is a particularly good one. I only have two things left because I didn't want to waffle on. But the next one is a piece that has been in a recent haul of mine. I will link that down below if you want to go and watch that. It was a clothing haul and also a beauty makeup haul. It was quite long, but I'll link it down below in the description if you want to go and see it. And it is also in, it was also in my June favourites, which I'll also link down below if you want to go and see. And it's this denim skirt here. This denim skirt is great. It looks good and when I wear it, I love it. So basically what I like about this mainly is the little stripe that goes down the side. This is definitely a trend piece. If there's a piece out of this whole kind of video, this would be the trendiest piece because, you know, a lot of people right now or a lot of brands are putting these stripes down the side of their jeans and their skirts. I saw, on, saw one online that was a black skirt with that stripe down the side and I really wanted to buy it because I just like the look of it. But then I saw this one in new look and I was like, hell yeah, literally grabbed it straight off the hanger, went and tried it on. This was a size 10 and... It fits perfectly. It is a little bit tight to get on, um, but once it's on, it's a perfect fit. It comes up very, very high-waisted, and it's not too short, which I also really like. I don't like it when skirts are too short, um, but I also like them to be high-waisted, so I can either wear this with a jumper and tights in the winter, or I can wear it with a T-shirt in summer. You can really wear this with quite a lot of outfits throughout the year, and that's why this was definitely one of my favourite fashion purchases that I've ever purchased good one good one and then finally for this kind of haul thing or whatever this video is um i have some dungarees so i should probably sort this out before i show you yeah some dungarees or a pinafore or whatever you call this it's not like dungarees in terms of trousers and shorts it's like a skirt dungaree thing so is that a pinafore i don't know but anyway that's what it looks like here sorry it's difficult to show um hopefully i can insert a picture over the screen showing you kind of me sort of wearing the top part part of this because i have got a picture of me wearing this but um it's a nice color hello sorry my camera likes to turn off um i really like this it's again one of those items that you can throw on over anything i could throw it on over this jumper um with some tights i could throw it on own on over a t-shirt anything absolutely anything so it really is quite versatile and you can make it look like such a different outfit i could literally wear this every single day and make my outfit look very very different so that's what i love about this and i also love the fact that it's a purple color i did have a black one previously to this and you know obviously i've got a lot of black items in my wardrobe i didn't want to 
keep going with the same kind of items so having a different color is just nice and i just think this goes really nicely with gray and i love this and i'm so glad i got it and it's definitely worth trying on because you might think oh that won't suit me go in try one on this one was from primark you never know you might love it which i personally do so that's the end of this styling video i will be doing some more fashion videos on my channel kind of different fashion videos um in t in terms of layout of the video so lookbooks things like that comment down below if you've got any ideas maybe that you want me to do i won't be doing that many hauls because i don't want to spend that much money but there's the odd thing here and there that i might buy and put in a vlog or something like that so thanks for watching this video please remember to subscribe it really does help me out well it doesn't help me out but i just like it so please subscribe um like the video if you liked it and i will see you in my next one goodbye